Hello again everybody and uh, welcome to another Edge Sculpture new presentation video. Uh, this time, as you can see, we've come to the jungles of East Asia. Yeah, Dan says East Asia because we <laughs> didn't know where the border was. I mean, literally 70 kilometres ago, we, we knew, thought we knew, we, we don't. And we haven't seen anything since, no. have we? No, the map was green. No, that's right. No compass. So we haven't seen anything since. We have. We see many, many eyes down, of all different shapes and sizes. And we don't know which ones are worse. The small little beady ones, of which there are eight, <laughs> or the big ones. We just haven't made our mind up yet, but it's... It's rife with it, isn't it, it, Dan? It is. It's horrible. And either way, I think they're yes. all deadly. And we always end up in this situation, don't yeah. we? Well, you know. Yeah, but there's a reason for that, though, don't <laughs> Which is You sculpt something wild, the only place you find them is in the wildness, Dan, yeah, isn't it? True, and, true. And with it, it becomes all the, all the teeth and limbs and power and muscle and uh, Okay, so fire water, part next time, then. Fish. If there's anyone down the road. Poisonous, venom, <laughs> all of it. <laughs> But anyway, here we are, nonetheless, with all the effort to bring the presentation to for a new uh, tiger sculpt. When I say new tiger sculpt, 13 years ago I sculpted a, a, a tiger bust with a snarling, fierce expression. And I really wanted to have a second go at it, not because I wasn't happy with that one, but it's 13 years, it's a long time. Mm -hmm. But the second time round, I wanted to do a different piece, a different expression. Yes, it's still very much head, but I wanted to go even larger than life with it. But I wanted to achieve a passively powerful expression with it. Um, and really, in a literal sense, if, you, if, you, if you've read books and or watched the Walt Disney presentations of things like The Jungle Book, <laughs> Shere Khan really, I suppose, is such an iconic uh, figure and demonstrates uh, what the attitude, I guess, to what we all expect a tiger to be, yeah, yeah. which is something that I wanted to bring out with the sculpt. So I didn't want it to be ferocious or fierce or terrifying. I just wanted to have that underlying power to it. Yeah, the solitary noble creature. Yeah, isn't but it? looking at you, not staring yeah. at you, but looking at you as though it would be if it was hunting. And again, like all the other sculpts I've done of this sort of size, light is very important. And what I mean by that is allowing the light to pass through. So if I stand away from the yep. back of the head, so you can have another look through the jungle, <laughs> as I'm just checking to make sure there's no, no, I'm, I'm all clear. You can see the light coming through the piece. And again, you can see the light passing all the way through it. Now on the back, what our painters has managed to do, painters, painter as well, um, have done a fantastic job uh, painting a jungle metallic green finish on the back. And again, even though you don't display the pieces at the back, we just think it adds a little bit more um, creativity and provenance yeah, to the piece absolutely. by doing it, doesn't it? A bit more, more artisticness. Yeah, yeah. Which leads <clears throat> me on to another new interpretation of this new sculpt we haven't released yet, Dan. No, this uh, is it. Yes, we, we released uh, this one at, yeah. uh, at the Spring Fair yeah. in, uh, in February. Um, but this one is probably the first time that most people have, yeah. have, would have seen it. Um, this is a, a white tiger, mm. and um, so they're both new introductions. Both hopefully, as when this video goes out, they should be available in the shops. Now we've only just sorted out the packaging, mm -hmm. um, so from the end of April to May, these pieces should be hitting the shops. They've done a nice finish in there as yep, well. Paint. So, so, after, so yeah, this yep. one's got a, a little bit of mix. As Dan's uh, <coughs> said, alluded to, there's a white um, tiger, in it, but it's got, it's got, I suppose, an ice gold finish in it. But going back to uh, ice and white. Now, previously, when we've uh, um, done a very similar painting pattern to this on a tiger before, we've actually called it a Siberian tiger. That isn't actually that accurate. Yes. The word Siberia does conjure up the notion of snow and ice, doesn't it, Dan? It does. But it isn't actually accurate to what the cat feline sculpt actually is. No. A Siberian tiger <coughs> is actually coloured like this. No really different to a Bengal tiger. Or indeed a Sumatran, which is even smaller. I say even smaller because a, a Siberian tiger is larger than a Bengal tiger. And that's what I wanted to try and achieve with the piece. So back to obviously where we find ourselves in Asia not just say India, that's where this tiger is. Another word for a Siberian tiger is a Manchurian tiger, which also conjures up the Far East. So you find them all over parts of 
uh, Russia and China, etc. So mm. it spreads yep. across that part of the globe. So that hopefully puts an, an explanation of what we mean by a side period time, because it does get very confusing, doesn't it, Dan? Yeah. 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 So, yeah. Hope you like the presentation. Hope you like the piece. And yeah, and please like and subscribe because it does help us out because we are trying to grow the channel. We have moved, so we are trying to look at doing more films, aren't we, Dan? Yeah, absolutely. And uh, obviously, yeah. if you subscribe, you will be notified yeah. um, with any new videos that we do bring out. And as Matt said, hopefully we'll be releasing more yeah. and more. Absolutely. So, but next we're going to do a, a, a go to, sorry, a 360 yeah. that I've produced uh, earlier. Absolutely. And uh, there you'll be able to see, obviously, a 360 all around uh, the piece without us two in it. Yeah, <laughs> might, might help you make your decision. <laughs> yeah. Or not. <laughs> so we've got to find our, yeah. our way out of here. We had. <laughs> Did you bring I, the machete? I'd say, well, yes, but it's, we say press the magic button, but we're also going to, we're going to leg it. We're going to get out of here pretty quick, <laughs> yeah. I think. All right, absolutely. Shall we, shall we to do it then? Yeah, go on. Okay, three, two, one, go. <laughs>